Hey guys, in today's video, I'm going to show you how to run diagnostics on your iPhone. In case you didn't know, Apple does provide tools that allow you to run diagnostics on your device in case you feel like your device may be having connection issues or audio issues or maybe even FaceTime or Face ID issues. You can actually test that before even taking your device to an Apple store. So I'm going to show you how easy it is to run diagnostics and enter diagnostic mode on your device. So let's go ahead and dive right in. Okay, so in order to run diagnostics on an iPhone, you're you're going to need two devices so i have another iphone here on the right which i'll be using to test and i have the iphone on the left which is the device that i'm going to be testing so what you need to do in order to enter a diagnostic mode you need to power off your iphone like you normally would so go ahead and power off your iphone and then you want to wait for the complete shutdown of the device and once it is completely shut down you're going to hold down the volume up and volume down keys together as you plug your iPhone into the charging cable, make sure it is connected to a power source, of course. So once it is completely powered down, you're gonna hold the two volume up and down buttons together and then plug your iPhone in to the power source. Once the Apple logo shows up on the screen, you can go ahead and release those two buttons and let's go ahead and wait for that, just like so, release. And now just wait for the diagnostic mode to kick in. Here in a few seconds, we'll see the iPhone enter into diagnostic mode. And now we're gonna go ahead and run the test we need a website we need apple's website to do this so i'll link this in the description down below it's going to be this website right here so let's go ahead and refresh here i haven't been active for a while so i have to refresh just like so and now we'll enter diagnostic mode on the iphone on the left just like that and on the right we have the website and apple's services in order to test this device on the left now a few things to note here this only works with ios 17 or later you can't be running any betas it does not work with betas and it also works on the Mac 14.1 or later as well. Now, once we're ready, we can click continue and then we'll select iPhone for this particular test. And then we're gonna enter the serial number for the iPhone that we're going to be testing. And you can find that by clicking on the I here on the screen of the iPhone. There is the serial number. Let's go ahead and enter the serial number. Once you enter the serial number, click start session and click start session on the iPhone that you're testing. And it's gonna ask you to connect to the Wi-Fi network. Just go ahead and do that as well. Once you enter the Wi-Fi password, the session will be initiated here. So in just a few few seconds we'll see the information or the tools populate here on the iPhone that we're using for testing here so let's go ahead and wait click agree and now we should enter the actual session in order to run diagnostics on the iPhone 14 Pro Max as you can see right there and in just a few seconds it will connect and now we're ready to go now we can run a few tests on things like the audio output as you can see right there we can also do display pixels we can also do the multi-touch so if you're having issues with the multi-touch on the screen of your iPhone you can run a diagnostics on that we also have face ID if you're having face ID issues this can give you information in regards to what's happening with face ID and you can take it into repair even camera image quality as well so you have a few things you can actually diagnose with this tool here again this is directly from Apple so you can go ahead and find all the links in the description down below once you're done you can end session right here click end session and then you can go into the iPhone and long press the side button in order to exit that session just like so and now we'll be back to normal the iPhone will reboot and you'll have your results and that is how you run diagnostics on your iPhone using Apple's tools and how to enter diagnostic mode on your iPhone thank you for watching guys I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful and I'll see you guys on the next one peace